What's up, y'all? It's Captain Brad with Choctahatchee Bay Fishing Charters. This is my very first YouTube video. Dude, everybody's told me. Oh, God. I... Hang on. Hang on. Did we get him? Did we get him? Come on. Oh, we're on. We're on. There he is, boy. We're on. Oh, come on. Yeah, I was, just got here my first cast. And uh, like I said, this is my first video. Um, you guys, dude, I'm going to put out some awesome videos, man. Everybody told me to start making YouTube videos and whatnot. So here we go. This is my first one, dude. Y'all better get ready. It's going to be awesome. <clears throat> Beautiful slot red. The first minute I was here. Oh man. Beautiful fish. Check him out. Check him out. Choctahatchee Bay Redfish right there. Oh yeah. Alright guys, we're back. Just got my second bait out. I'm just gonna set the rod down and talk to you guys about where we're fishing at. <clears throat> so right here in Choctahatchee Bay, it's located between Santa Rosa Beach and Fort Walton Beach, and most of you know the Destin area. So, dude, huge lakes, like 27 miles long, a few miles wide. Um, great fishery, man. Uh, lots of trout, redfish. Uh, yeah. The bite's been so hot, man, the last few days. So, I'm glad you guys get to come along with us. Watch, watch how we're doing this. Seeing all these fish we're catching. Dude, it took less than one minute, less than one minute to get a bite a while ago. Redfish are hungry. Caught a monster trout yesterday. I'll, I'll post a picture for you guys from yesterday. Uh, it wasn't a monster, but it's a monster from my area. It was a 20 inch trout. You know, that's a, that's a big one from around here. It ain't no Galveston Bay trout, you know, but it's a, it's a big one. All right, guys, we're still waiting on that second bite, but Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna tell you what I'm doing. I'm using a Carolina rig or slip lead rig, whatever you want to call it. Um, got me a live bait on, uh, and I'm fisting to rig up. Actually, I've already got it rigged up. Fisting to cast it out. A free line bait. That means just a leader and a hook. That's it. And uh, let that way he's swimming around more natural and more on the surface, up in the upper uh, part of the water column. Uh, see if we can't stick this one in the big old trout again. All right, guys, I think we're getting bit again. Let's see. Yeah, he's got it, boys. I use a really light drag when I'm using these big old baits. That way they can run and uh, or they can eat the bait, you know. Here he goes. I think he's still on. We're going to tighten down the drag a little bit. When he hits it one more time, the hook should set and be on there. All right, guys, still waiting on this fish to take off with his bait. He actually might have it. Looks like the line's coming around the boat. Um, <clears throat> so what I'm doing here is I use a real light drag for the initial strike. Um, that way, I'm using a big bait, make sure they eat it and the hook gets in there. Um, so anyway, <clears throat> I am fixing to reel down on this fish and see if I got him. I believe I do. Oh, I just pulled it from him. No, nope, he's still there. He's still there. He's still there. We got him. We got him. Still there. He's running straight at the boat. What do we got? What do we got? Small redfish. Small redfish. Okay. 
right guys so just call a small red probably 16 inches or so it wasn't very big um what i was wanting to tell you guys is i sat here for 10 15 minutes and i got a couple of hits right nothing actually took the bait so <clears throat> what i did i brought in my bait and it looked there was no scales left on it whatsoever and um so what happened was they basically just stripped the scales off of it the fish just looked nasty i wouldn't have wanted to eat it so i put brand new fresh bait on and a minute later hit it so make sure you guys use beautiful baits when you throw them out there yes you'll get this weird fish that comes along and he wants a nasty ugly bait he'll eat it whatever but i put that pretty bait out there less than a minute i had a fish hit it that's a tip